Greetings and welcome back to Fallout 4. I am Patronus. As you play through the main story of the Far Harbor, uh, Dima will send you here to a place called the Nucleus. He's sending you here because he has memories of this location that he feels are too dangerous if they fell into the hands of the Children of Adam. So he gives you a holotape called Faraday's Program, which allows you to hack the command center. As you can see, there are currently five memories that he that you can play that you can uh, hack with the Faraday's uh, holotape. Now, to actually finish the main storyline of the game, of oh, sorry, of the Far Harbor, you really only need to hack the first three. But if you hack all five of them, you get access to a special piece of equipment called the Marine Armor. And this is the Marine Armor. It's kind of ugly, kind of bulky. But once you complete all five of Dima's memories at the command center in the Nucleus, your map will be updated with the location of this armor. Now it's actually spread across three locations, and all three locations will be updated at the same time. All three locations are underwater, so you'll have to do a bit of swimming because it kind of makes sense that it's called Marine Armor. You know. Anyway, you also get one other piece of armor at the when you actually uh, when you go to those locations as well. But I wouldn't really call it armor. You get the Marine Tactical Helmet and you get the Marine Wetsuit. And as you can see, when I equipped the Marine Wetsuit, I it unequipped my Marine my military fatigues. So it is treated as if uh, it is treated like a piece of a uh, like some clothing you can put armor over. That's what the head looks like. Kind of kind of green bug eye kind of thing. It's kind of neat. Uh, it, it is said that this is used for like reconnaissance, like at uh, work, you know, at night. It's like a stealth suit, except it doesn't make you invisible, which is kind of unfortunate because it'd be kind of nice if that was an, an actual thing that could be done in the game. But let's see what I'll show you what it looks like outside of the, uh, here we are. So yeah, this is what it looks like. Like I said, it looks like, uh, you know, it looks similar to the Chinese stealth armor, except, you know, it, it's different. It looks different. It'd be kind of nice if you could uh, crouch down and go invisible. That'd be great. Now, here's the unfortunate thing about this wetsuit here. You can't apply Ballistic Weave to it. So, you only get 10 Energy, 10 Ballistic, and 10, uh, you know, Rad. And then 5, 5, and 5 as well. So, it provides more protection than most uh, items that you wear that you can put armor over. But that's really about it, though. And so, yep, that's it right there. Now, by completing all five memories, you'll get out, you'll get the locations for this. You go there, pick it up, and there you have it. I intend to take this into Nuka World with me, and uh, it's going to be a fun time. Well, yeah, yeah, that's it for the video. Thank you for watching. Uh, if you liked, please comment, subscribe. Well, have a great day.